I created supportourshields.com because I wanted to support the men and women of law enforcement. I'm proud to say I've had members of my family who have served in law enforcement. When I was five years old, I told my parents that I wanted to be a police officer when I grew up. I actually went into media. And the current manipulation of the public by the mainstream media disturbs me. Since they use tragedies, particularly when it's a person who looks like me, and they selectively edit and cover the story in a certain way to produce a particular narrative. Last year in the wake of the riots and the defund the police movement, I felt compelled to get plaques made and present them to police departments in the county that I live in. It was an amazing encounter every time I got a chance to meet and uh, share my story with a police chief and the other officers. My story is a kid who grew up in poverty in the inner city of Fort Lauderdale, Florida. In the year 1987, there were three different crack houses on the street that I lived on. Uh, so police were constantly in the neighborhood Despite that, my interactions with police officers were very positive. In fact, a lot of my coaches in sports, in particular football, were police officers. They were so appreciative that someone from the community was coming in who wasn't looking for an endorsement or running for a political office, but just to tell them that they supported them, they cared about them, cared about their families, that, that I was praying for them. That made such a difference for them. So I wanted to take what I was doing in my local community on a broader level and to reach at least one police department in every state of the country and to share my message of support and appreciation for them. Also to produce videos that highlight some of the amazing things these men and women do in their communities that the media will never cover because it doesn't fit the propaganda that they want to push. We're at a very pivotal moment in our country. And I'm gonna to continue to stand with law enforcement and not be ashamed to say, I support our shields.